great day everyone. Today, I will show you how to use the hazardous waste management system in securing a hazardous wastes generator's ID. Let's start. Open the hazardous waste management system. You may search for it in Google or access the link provided in the description below. In the login page, type your email address as the username and your password to access your account. Then click the sign in button. Once you had successfully logged in on your account, you will see in the screen all applications related to your account. Since this is the first time, we are using the HWMS, no application is reflected. To apply for a hazardous wastes generator's ID, select the generator in the menu located on the left side of the page. Then, click Applications in the drop-down menu. Next, click the green button labeled New Generator Registration on the upper right corner of the screen to proceed. Hazwaste ID registration is divided into five steps. First, you will be required to provide the basic information of your project. The first question is whether you have a previous ballot approved registration. If you select, yes, you will be asked to provide a PDF copy of the certificate. If you don't have any approved registration, just select no. Next, on the general information, provide the details of the company. Make sure that there are no typographical errors. After finishing the step one, click the next button on the upper right corner of the page to proceed. Your application will be automatically saved once you reach step two where you will be required to provide information on your environmental compliance permits. In step number two, click the link to access your profile provided in the left side of the screen. Once your profile is loaded, under the table for environmental compliance permits click the Add Permit button on the right side of the screen. In the dialog box, you will be able to add permits issued by the EMB for your project. First select the type of clearance or permit, for example an environmental compliance certificate. Then provide the ECC number, date and place of issuance, and upload the PDF copy of the certificate. For permits and clearances that does not expire, just leave the expiry date blank. Finally, click the Add Permit button to proceed. You must add all existing and valid permits and clearances that you have secured from EMB. After uploading the environmental compliance permits, Go back to your application by clicking the Applications menu on the left side menu bar. Click the Update button on the right side of the application that you are working on. Double check the details on step number 1 before clicking the Next button. Under step number 2, all the environmental compliance permits that you had added in your profile will be reflected. Check the details before clicking the Next button. In step number 3, you will be asked to declare all the products or services of your company. Click the Add More button on the right side of the screen. In the dialog box that will appear, provide a description of your product or services, then click the Add button. Once finished, click Next to proceed. 
Step number four will require you to declare all the hazardous wastes generated in your company. Click the Add More button on the right side of the screen to proceed. In the dialog box, select from the drop-down menu the type of wastes you generate, its nature and catalog. Then provide details of the wastes and the current waste management practice. Click the Add Waste Profile button to proceed. Make sure that all hazardous wastes are declared because it will be reflected in your registration. Click the next button to proceed to step number 5 where you will now upload all the attachments of your application. Take note that all files must be below 5 MB and in PDF format. All documents with asterisk are required to have an attachment. To upload a document, click the green button labeled Add Files, select the files that you will upload. Then select the appropriate file types in the drop-down menu, then click the Save button. After uploading all the required attachments, click the blue button labeled Finalize Application. The terms and conditions will be loaded, click the I Agree button to proceed. Congratulations! You just finished submitting your application for Hazardous Wastes ID registration. It will now be reviewed and evaluated by EMB personnel. Check your account in the HWMS from time to time to be updated of your application status. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and hit the notification button to keep you updated of my future videos. Thank you.